this is Rick Brandenburg for North Carolina State University Turf Bugs and Rock and Roll. And you know I've talked a lot about soapy water flushes and these various uh, these various videos that we do. And it still is a very important tool where you take a little bit of dishwashing detergent, put it in some water, then you pour that out over an area. And it really brings mole crickets to the surface quickly if you've got sod webworms, army worms, cutworms, these sorts of things that come to the surface. And one point I want to make, it sometimes takes two or three or even four minutes for the insects to come up and be visible. That doesn't mean you walk off and check your text messages or whatever. It means you stay right here and you watch because sometimes they come up quickly. And when they come up, sometimes they'll more or less play possum and then you won't see them. So it's really important. Um, some people say, well, I use it for mole crickets for egg hatch. Another thing you can use it a little bit later in the summer to see when the crickets get to be more than a half inch long. Once they get more than a half inch long, you've really got to start getting more aggressive with the products that you use to control them. And it's obviously a, a good tool to use when it comes to um, things like fall armorworm. You see birds, you go in that area, put a soapy water flush out, and if you've got fall armorworms there, they'll be revealed in a matter of a couple minutes. So it's a good tool. Be real careful on bent grass. If you use a, a high concentration in the hot summer, you can actually scorch it, and even Bermuda sometimes in hot weather, if you put too much soap in there. So a couple of, uh, couple of tablespoons in a gallon of water is plenty strong enough. Hope that helps. Look forward to seeing you again next time.